Namaste DP fam and welcome back to the channel. Today we are diving into the wonderful world of indoor plants. They not only elevate our home decor but also provide a range of health benefits. I will share my personal favorites too including my first plants the zizi plant and the pothos and we will also discuss on how to choose the right lighting for them. Now whether you are a plant newbie or a seasoned green thumb I have got some tips and inspiration for you. First, let us talk about the benefits of indoor plants. First off, let's talk about why you should consider adding plants to your space. Indoor plants not only enhance your decor but also improve air quality, boost your mood and create a calming environment. Who wouldn't want that, right? Now when it comes to choosing plants, consider your space and lifestyle. Low light areas go for snake plants or pothos. If you have a sunny spot, succulents or fiddle leaf figs are great options. Remember, the right plant for your space makes all the differences. Now let's get into styling. Here are some creative ideas. First, grouping the plants. Mix and match different heights and textures. Place smaller plants on the shelves and larger ones on the floor to create a layered look. Use stands to elevate your plants and hangers to utilize vertical space. This adds dimension to your decor. Choose pots that complement your home's color scheme. Terracotta for a rustic feel or a sleek white pots for a modern touch. Consider a statement plant like a monstera or a tall palm to serve as a centerpiece in your living area. Don't worry, keeping your plants healthy doesn't have to be hard. Here are some quick maintenance tips. For watering, check the soil moisture before watering. Overwatering is a common mistake. For dust, wipe the leaves regularly to keep them clean and photosynthesizing efficiently. For the lights, rotate your plants to ensure even growth. Now let's talk about some indoor plants that I own. Let's start with the ZZ plant. One of my first plants, its glossy dark green leaves are stunning and it thrives in low light making it perfect for dim corners of your home. It requires minimal watering so it's ideal for those who might forget to tend to their plants. Plus it's excellent at filtering toxins from the air. Next, let's talk about the money plant or the pothos. Pothos is highly versatile and comes in various types like golden pothos and marble queen. It can thrive in both low light and bright indirect sunlight. The key is to avoid direct sunlight, which can scorch its leaves. Pothos also exhales at air purifications, removing harmful chemicals from the space. Now let's talk about the spider plants. I have two beautiful varieties, one with the vibrant yellow striped leaves and one with the white striped leaves. Both are stunning and can really brighten up any room. Spider plants love bright indirect light but are very adaptable so they can also do well in the low light conditions. They produce adorable baby plants making them fun to propagate. 
plus they are excellent air purifiers filtering out all the harmful pollutants Moving on to the areca palm which thrives in bright indirect light. It's perfect for adding a tropical feel to your space. Areca palms can grow quite tall and serve as beautiful statement plants. They also act as natural humidifiers which is beneficial in dry indoor environments. While I love how it looks, I have found it a bit tricky to care for. But with past experiences, I got to know that this plant thrives in bright indirect light and need consistent moisture, but can also be sensitive to overwatering. It's essential to ensure proper drainage to avoid root rot. Next, we have the snake plant. This plant is incredibly versatile. It can survive in low light and also flourishes in bright conditions. It's low maintenance and only needs watering when the soil is dry. Plus, it converts carbon dioxide into oxygen at night, improving your indoor air quality while you sleep. Finally, the jade plant. This succulent love bright indirect sunlight and can thrive in direct light as well. It's easy to care for and can last for years with proper attention. Jade plants are also air purifying and are known to symbolize good luck and prosperity. So there you have it. Indoor plants can truly elevate your home decor while providing a host of benefits. Start small. experiment with different placements and most important enjoy the process thanks for joining me today if you found this video helpful please like subscribe and share your favorite indoor plants in the comments below happy planting and i will see you in the next video super soon till then stay fit stay healthy and bye bye